a mini band workout for you today. So if you got a set of mini bands, let's get it done. It's going to be 50 seconds of work, 10 seconds rest. This is all strength. There's no cardio in here, okay? Times 40 total rounds. Um, it is upper body all in one segment. Then we're going to do lower body. How we're going to work it is a single arm moves and single leg moves. So we're going to do right and left, make the body even. Then we'll go back through that set. So you're going to do all upper body at one time. Then if you need to pause your timer or anything like that to get set for your lower body, you can do so. We're going to do all lower body at one time. Okay. Even if you have knee issues, you should be able to do all of these mini band moves with your legs without any kind of problem. Okay. So our first exercise is a lat pull in. So remember we're doing single arm, right arm, then left arm. So I'll turn sideways if you want to go forward, drawing that elbow back and behind. So you can either pull with your thumb or pull with your forefinger. I'm just driving it in and back, squeezing our shoulder blade in and then back up. If you need less tension, you can move that top arm over a little bit. If you need more tension, you can move it further away or you can introduce your band. Getting that elbow too helps, but really squeezing that shoulder blade back and in and releasing it out. So right and left, then we have our tricep push down. We've done this here in the gym. So keeping that band here for less, across the body for more, driving that down and across, making sure that you're not shooting your arm way out here. You wanna push with the back of that hand and really feel that tricep flex, okay? Then right and left on that, then we have our kneeling row. So band's gonna go underneath the opposite foot. Okay, we made these rounds a little bit longer, so if you have a hard time getting in and out of your band, you've got plenty of time still to get that work done. Okay, so driving opposite hand across the body, squeezing that shoulder blade in, and then releasing it out. Making sure that that band is not pulling your arm back. You need to control it in both directions. And then we have our concentration curl, so we're just gonna keep it on the same foot. So it's the same foot and arm. Elbow is locked inside of that leg. You're curling up and down. This can have a tendency to bite into the hand, so just make sure if you need less on your hand, you can put it across the heel of your hand and drive that up towards your shoulder and you're still going to get a good bicep burn. And then our final exercise is a lateral raise. So again, if you need less tension, you can move that band closer to your arm, more tension away. But all you're doing is slight bit in that elbow, raising up and lowering. Just like if you had a dumbbell in your hand, you're going to raise and lower, just making sure here that when you get tired, that trap does not come up. Don't let that shoulder shrug. Keep it relaxed, raise, and lower. So right and left of all moves, all the way through those five exercises, then back to the top, do them again. Okay, so once we're done with arms, we're done. Then we have our fun, fancy leg moves. So putting those bands around your ankles, okay? Bracing onto a wall if you need to for balance. We're gonna start with a kickback. This is a single leg, slight bend in that base leg, and you're just extending it back and down, back and down. You should feel that under your butt and in those hamstrings, making sure when you extend that foot, you're not leaning, you're not swaying your back, okay? It's all in the leg. Extend, small extension, and return. So it is good to have a place to hold on to if you need to, to help you balance, so you really focus on the leg and not the lean or the balance, okay? So right and left of that, then we have our lateral leg raise, same premise, but we're gonna go out now. Base leg stays still, lift and lower, lift and lower, working the abductor, adductor, and the outside of that booty. Then we have a lying leg curl. Um, you wanna go <laughs> sideways, I'll go backwards? Okay, that's <laughs> it's kind of like trying to figure out, hey. Trying <laughs> to get down on that floor, same thing, one leg goes the entire time, flexing one foot, drawing the other one in towards the butt, my band ran. Your band, your band moving. And back out. In towards your butt, working those hamstrings, and back out. Nice and controlled with that movement. It's not about going fast. The slower you take it, especially with the tension in that band, the more you're going to feel that booty working. Okay? If you need to, um, if you're having issues with your band like Chelsea did, you can put it under your feet yeah, instead of around your ankles. Okay? And then that'll make it where um, it doesn't roll on you. And then we're going to move our band up to around our thighs and work a clamshell. Okay, so <laughs> I know what you're thinking of laughing <laughs> over there. <laughs> so you're going to be on the floor that entire time. We're working that, that butt cheek again. So lifting that leg up, nice and controlled, lower. Okay, the stronger this band is, 
the harder this is going to be. So you don't want to open those legs really wide. It's not about how wide you can open the leg. It's about feeling that butt moving your leg. So it's a controlled movement. There's a small muscle, okay, called the glute med that runs on the outside of your butt cheek. That's what you want to focus on, okay? And then we'll do right and left of that, and then we'll do seated leg extension. So we're going to take that band back to the ankles, sitting down on the edge, on a chair, on your couch, works on the couch, see? And then all you're going to do is extend that same leg the whole time, working that quad, extending and lowering, extending and lowering. You should feel that tension right in the top of that leg. Again, this is slow and controlled. You got 50 seconds to go through these, so not it's not a race. Feel that working. And then you're gonna go through that leg set again, and then you're done. You should be sweating, but there was no cardio, y'all. No cardio. You're welcome. Okay, that's our Christmas gift to you. No cardio. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I hope you enjoy the video. Um, we will see you guys next week. Love you. Hey, okay, bye.